Okay, this is going to be a demonstration on how to manually set a talking atomic watch. Uh, there's two ways of doing it. Uh, if you look at the directions when you got the watch, you'll see that you can sync it up to the satellite location that's coming from Colorado Springs. But I'm going to show you a quick, easy way to manually set the time. There's four buttons on this atomic watch. They're located in the 2 o'clock, the 3 o'clock, the 8 o'clock, and the 10 o'clock position. So when you push the 2 o'clock, it's going to announce the time. The time. And if you hit the 4 o'clock, it's going to tell you the date and the year. Today is Thursday, July 10, year 2014. Okay. If I hit the 10 o'clock, it's going to tell me if the alarm is on or off. Alarm is off. Okay. And if I hit the 8 o'clock, it's going to tell me whether or not the time zone is set correct. USA. Time not updated. Okay. So what we're going to do is once we set the, the correct time zone, the watch will automatically set to the correct time. So what we're going to do is we're going to hold the 8 o'clock in for a couple seconds until you hear another prompt. Set alarm. Press 10 o'clock button to set. Okay. So what we're going to do is keep pushing it until we hear the time zone. Alarm on. Off. Press 10 o'clock button to set. So. Chime on. Off. Press 10 o'clock button to set. Okay. Hit it one more time. Time zone setting. Press 10 o'clock button to set. Okay, so now we're going to hit the 10 o'clock. Press 2 o'clock button to set 8 o'clock button to confirm. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to hit the 2 o'clock and then the 8 o'clock to confirm. So 2 o'clock is going to change the time zone. USA Eastern. Okay, so we are in the Eastern time zone right now. So I'm going to hit the 8 o'clock and it's going to change it from a, a couple of minutes after 9 to a couple of minutes after 10. So once I hit it, confirm. can I confirm? Oh, and if you look at the hands, they're automatically going to take off and it will get to the correct time and it'll stop and then if you hit the two o'clock button it'll announce the correct time now the speaker is located underneath the bottom of the watch so most people when they push the two o'clock to listen to the time they bring the watch a little closer to their ear so they don't disturb people um, this is not a water resistant watch so you have to be really careful that you don't get too close to the water with these uh, particular watches um, it's a very popular watch it's been on the market for a couple of years and it's a very popular watch that we sell here at magnifying aids so if you have any other questions you can actually visit our website magnifyingaids.com or you can give us a call at our company 727-526-2020